of alopecia, um, and I have alopecia. <laughs> um, alopecia is an autoimmune deficiency that basically prevents me from growing hair, and I have been wearing wigs ever since I was 10 years old. It's been a huge part of kind of my personality, my self-identity, my self-expression. I love embracing the ball, don't get me wrong, but it's also fun to kind of rock different hairstyles um, on a day-to-day -day basis. So it's been a really fun time um, trying on all of these different wigs. But enough about me, let's talk about one of Tressa Lore's most famous, most popular units, which is their sensational unit. So not only am I going to be talking about the sensational unit, um, I'm also going to show it to you in three different colors, which I cannot wait. So I have a brown, I have a blonde, and I have a redhead, um, which is my favorite, by the way. <laughs> um, but let's get into the real reason why you clicked on this video. I'm going to try my best to give you a good amount of specs, um, but just know that if you go to wigs.com, if you look up the sensational unit by Tressa Lore, all of their specs are neatly and um, they're described perfectly on their website and they also have a picture of all of the different colors that it comes in which it comes in a lot of different colors so if you're not impressed by the three colors that i will show you today i promise you i think there's like 20 more <laughs> so introducing miss sensational so let's talk about her so sensational is a heat friendly synthetic um, which is awesome. Synthetics have come such a long way. You can now use heat on it. Um, the recommendation is 275 to 300 degree Fahrenheit. Um, so very low heat, but honestly, this, like the style, this butterfly kind of wavy style, it's so in right now. So you can definitely use heat, but I'm not planning on it because I absolutely love the way that it looks. But let's talk a little bit about the cap construction. So we've got um, a lace front with a monofilament top. We have a close or <laughs> does it look closed? No, it's definitely open. We have an open wefted back, which is so good for breathability um, for people who are in higher climates. And then we've got little adjustment straps at the back, which is Velcro. Love a good Velcro. Honestly, if adult shoes came in Velcro, I would absolutely choose them that way. Okay, let's throw her on. Super easy just to throw on. She might be a little wacky. Let's give her a little brush. Okay, so this is the first one. And she is in the color. Where's this tag? <laughs> She's already so stunning already. Okay, so this is in the color 747T. 747T. Oh my goodness, I love her. I have not yet given her a part so maybe we should do that now um, just so you guys can see what it looks like the amazing thing about the lace front is you can part it wherever you want and it's gonna look absolutely sensational <laughs> okay that's the best that i can do without a mirror Let's give her a little brush oh my goodness she is so gorgeous Wow, wow, wow. Let's just adjust her accordingly. Okay, guys, I'm obsessed. I don't know about you guys, but like, look at these layers. It's just, it's so, so, so incredibly sunny. You can tuck it behind your ears. Um, you can add a little bit of product if these little hairs are coming in to your face. Okay, let me give you guys an up close on the hairline and then I will switch through to the other one. Let's just put this on the other side. Like how incredible is that? Wow. Wow, wow, wow. I don't know her length, but I'm sure it's listed on the website. She is so gorgeous. I'm quite a short person. I'm five foot one. And this is where it comes down to. I'm gonna cough now, excuse me. <coughs> Oh my goodness. Guys, this is such a beautiful and also sexy wig, I must say. So gorgeous. Okay, let's move on to the second one, which is gonna be a nice transition because it's a blonde. 
So again, this is in the color 747T. And like literally round of applause for that first color. It was such, such a stunning brunette because it also had some warm red tones in it. Chef's kiss. Okay, let's try this one on next. And my hairbrush is attached to it. Again, easy to throw on if you are in a rush. I always like to call myself a lazy alopecia because I really don't love taking the time um, if I need to like glue down a wig or like tape it down. I just like something that's easy to work with. Oh my goodness, okay, I need a comb again. So when you are opening your box for the Sensational or basically for any kind of synthetic wig, you're gonna notice that it's gonna come with a bit of a zigzag part and don't fret, it's not always gonna look that way. Um, that just means you have to create a part of your own. Oh my goodness, she's so gorgeous. Look how natural this wig is. It actually looks like it's growing out of my scalp. Wow, 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 wow. Okay, let me tell you this gorgeous color. So this is in the color 14 slash 26 slash R10. So again, color 14 slash 26 slash R10. Come on, get it out of here. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. So I very much prefer a middle part. I think it's just to even out these amazing layers, but you can obviously part it to the side if you like. I just keep touching it because it is just, it's such a soft, silky smooth synthetic material. This is truly a high quality synthetic wig. Synthetic wigs have come such a long way since I started wearing them um, back when I was 10 years old. They were a little bit rough, so I am so impressed. I'm so glad that they've improved because they're such a budget-friendly option. And honestly, a lot of them look amazing like the Sensational. Oh my goodness, she is so gorgeous! and she lays very flat. You can't feel any of the wefts. She's comfortable, easy to throw on. Oh my goodness. Okay, last one. Ta-da! Oh my goodness, guys, this red is insane. Okay, let's throw her on. I love a good hair flip. All right, let's give her a bit of a brush. I should be using a wide tooth comb. They're better for synthetics, but I couldn't find one today. So this is gonna have to do. Oh my goodness, guys, this is so much fun trying on different wigs. Like a moment for the red. Like how stunning is this? And also the specs that I mentioned at the beginning, they're all the same specs for all of these. This is the same wig in three different colors, just to make that perfectly clear. Wow. obsessed oh my goodness guys you gotta get this wig it is so so stunning and like you just get effortless how, what was it is effortless beautiness <laughs> is that even a way to say that um just an effortless look you really don't have to do anything to it you don't have to add any heat if you don't want to because this is what it looks like right out of the box minus the zigzag part but again super easy just to create your own part like you would with your own hair i am feeling myself in this wig so incredibly gorgeous okay let me put all of the wigs side by side so you guys can see the difference in the color. All right. 
which is your guys' favorite? Honestly, I think mine's the red. Definitely love the red. But honestly, the blonde has so many different dimensions of color. And also, this brunette is just so subtle. But when you look close at it, there's just so much going on. I love it. Oh my goodness! Yay! Okay, guys, that is the end of my live. I hope you guys found this helpful. I hope you guys buy yourself a sensational unit by Tressa Lore. Even if you're not a huge fan of the sensational, I would highly recommend going to check out Tressa Lore. They have literally something for everyone. Um, all of their wigs are just absolutely stunning. Absolutely stunning. But thank you guys so much for watching this live. I hope to be back soon. Have a fantastic day and go slay the day away. Okay, bye guys. I always forget to blow. <laughs>